A welcome reception was held this week for the new Cuban ambassador to the Bahamas, His Excellency Ernesto Soberon Guzman, at Super Club's Breezes Resort in Cable Beach. Other members of the diplomatic corps attended the reception to welcome the new ambassador to the Bahamas. This year, Cuba and the Bahamas are celebrating 39 years of bilateral relations. Foreign Affairs Minister, Deputy Prime Minister Brent Simonet and the new Cuban ambassador complemented each other on a strong bond. We um, signed a delimitation boundary agreement a, uh, a little while ago and the ambassador just informed me that it was officially ratified in Cuba this week. So we're very pleased at that. Uh, we're looking forward to a number of other issues that we hope to deal with in terms of, of not only the, the technical agreement with regard to the, the two teachers we have here, um, also some, some medical issues and also probably some agricultural assistance too. We have to help one each other because this is, we are in the same ship and we have to work together to keep this ship floating, you know, because uh, this, uh, this is a crucial moment for the humanity and all of the countries need to help and work together in that moment. Former Foreign Affairs Minister, PLP Member of Parliament Fred Mitchell and Democratic National Alliance Leader Branville McCartney were also at that reception and say they are pleased with relations with Cuba. They're our neighbor and it's good for us to have good relationship and to work beneficially for the people of this region and for, for our countries and the people of our respective countries. We have a lot to offer each other and work together. So I'm looking forward to, to the relationship even getting better.